Hello, everyone, and welcome to the third installment of the Metric Minute, brought to you by Vault Performance. I'm Kareem Durkawi, and this episode covers eccentric duration, a metric that analyzes counter movement jump strategy and helps measure fatigue. Simply stated, eccentric duration is the time an athlete requires to descend from an upright standstill to the lowest point of the squat before jumping up. This metric is valuable for many reasons. Since relatively considerable force is required to decelerate body mass speeding downward, some heavier athletes descend slower to extend the eccentric time and minimize the braking power required. This strategy is also a hallmark of athletes with injuries or others with low eccentric strength or rate of force development capacity. Another use for eccentric duration is in fatigue monitoring. As mentioned, significant braking power is required if an athlete drops quickly for a jump. A longer eccentric phase will reduce required braking power and give the athlete time to muscle through the movement rather than explode upward. The take home message is that eccentric duration informs us about movement strategy and compensations that occur when an athlete's fatigued or injured. Force decks can determine duration, velocity, as well as braking power during the eccentric phase, in addition to squat depth and many other key metrics. We will discuss all of those in future episodes, but for more information, feel free to reach out to us at Vault Performance. Thank you very much.